Over the past 15 years, my colleagues and I have been obsessed with one thing above all others, and that is transformation, business transformation and leadership transformation told through stories of success. And when I talk about transformation, I mean how otherwise ordinary leaders, teams and organisations become extraordinary. And the one thing that I've learned in that time above all others is that transformation is not a matter of intention. It's not a matter of noble intention. It's a matter of alignment. Why do I say that? Because all leaders have noble intentions. I've never met the leader who aspires to destroy shareholder value, irritate customers and alienate staff. Yet 70% of all transformation efforts fail. And so this gap between uh, intention, noble intention and reality is not only my obsession, it's my primary frustration in life because I think it's the source of value destruction in our organisations and exhaustion in our leaders. So for those leaders who are looking to bridge the gap between their intention and their reality, their impact in, uh, in their day-to-day -day working life, the most important part of how a leader makes that transformation is why they want to transform in the first place or what we call the fire. And the critical shift is to shift from what is typically called a burning platform, a fear-driven, urgency-driven need to change, toward a burning ambition. The shift from burning platform to burning ambition uh, is the hallmark of all leaders who shift and sustain that shift over time. So while a burning platform can get us started, it's the burning ambition that allows us to sustain transformation over time. In order to make this shift from burning platform to burning ambition, as a leader, both for ourselves and for others, the most important thing we can do is inspire hope, not fear. Now, we tend to think of hope as an emotion, but in fact, hope is a process. Um, it's goals, times, uh, pathways to reach those goals, times a sense of agency. And by agency, I mean, uh, how does my effort make a difference? When we have an organisation which top to bottom understands what we're striving for, the key strategies and pathways to get there, and believes that they individually can make a difference, then you have organisations that can transform and make the shift and the leaders can lead that transformation.